हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू द सेशन एंड इस सेशन में हम जानेंगे हाउ टू प्रिपेयर दी नैलिट एग्जाम यहां पर आपको एग्जाम पैटर्न और कट ऑफ सैलरी और प्रिपरेशन का जो स्ट्रेटजी है तो इस सेशन में हम देखने वाला है एंड यू नो देर आर वेरियस गवर्नमेंट एग्जाम्स एंड देर आर वेरियस एग्जाम्स दट यू मे अटेम्प्ट आफ्टर दी बी टेक और ड्यूरिंग फाइनल ईयर ऑफ यूर बी टेक एंड इट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टू नो if you have uh, you know two to three months of preparation time you can easily crack exams like uh, the uh, nilit you know uh, at least if you have two to four months of time and you can uh, finish the syllabus if you are already prepared for gate and if you are in final year and you wanted to prepare for nilit exam you can also do within a uh, few months of uh, time you can complete the syllabus the advantage of a uh, preparation of nilit exam is you know you will get a job but at the same time you know you no need to work hard like other exams that you prepare for gate or you know the it jobs so it's easy to crack this exam so anybody who are interested for the job after btech you can give one try for exam the only the difference is you know you need to prepare for the many subjects and that not to be you know in depth so that's why you can complete this syllabus as quickly as possible okay yeah aish dabani right so any exam notification that we already uh, posted on the youtube channel so you can uh, check the exam notification in either video section or live section and we have already taken to you know uh, list out and you might aware like this exam is wait i'm sorry was doing something <coughs> just give me a time you can see the total vacancies already announced at the 78 vacancies and the exam notification was there and uh, many people were already aware of the notification and you can see there are three kinds of vacancies which were mentioned cs it and ec and you can see the category wise the vacancies and for computer science 19 vacancies and for it 16 vacancies for ec there are a lot of vacancies 43 so combined you have cs and it you have 30 uh, five right so almost you have 35 vacancies for both cs and it together so now let's see what is the pattern of this exam the pattern is very simple you have objective questions which are omr based and total questions will be 121 mark type and there are no negative marking so there is no negative marking means it's not difficult for you because in gate exam due to negative marking uh, even though you attempted a lot of questions correct because of negative you will get less marks then attempted so now here you have no issue and 3 hours time you will have you will be having total questions of uh, that you have from two sections so two sections individually you should get the cut off so generic area you will be having 42 questions that means uh, 42 marks and from technical area you will be having 78 marks so oh, total you will be having 120 marks paper so compared to a gate exam gate exam is 100 marks paper there you have um, 65 questions but you, you have here the 42 plus 78 total 120 questions each question carries one mark so one mark questions basically you will be having easy rather than you know the gate pattern so when you are preparing for gate pyqs the most of the concepts will be covered for the nilit exam okay and if you look at the uh, cut off for qualifying written examination so you see that 50% for general and ews both of them <coughs> 40% you need to uh, get for obc candidates and 30% for sc st pw uh, category and the cut off marks specified would be applicable in overall marks so total 120 marks based on that this cut off is decided and also you will be seeing that technical and generic uh, sessions separately and combined so you need to aware that so attempt well even generic session or you know 
the technical section. Both of them you should attempt well. Now, if you look at the salary for the analyst jobs, that's NIC job, the scientific assistant, the level fix, the pay scale will be uh, 35,400 to 112,400 rupees. Okay, this is a very good uh, pay scale. Great. Yes. Uh, so, as per the notification, like, uh, please read the notification. If the notification says that before applying, you need to be, you know, uh, passed out, then you will mostly not be eligible. But if you are passing out, you know, uh, as per the notification, always read the notification. So, it's very easy to read the notification, right? Go to the website and download the notification and look at whether you are uh, eligible or not. So, passed out mostly eligible, only final year. There will be dilemma because there will be a month where you need to submit your documents. So look at that month. By that month, if you are uh, getting your degree, then you will be qualified. Okay. And uh, these days, every university is not having the same month. Correct. So you should look at your month. And now, what is the syllabus that you should prepare? And you look at those people who prepared for the gate. For them, almost easy, except a few topics like analog and digital communication. And that is the one you need to aware and another one information systems and software engineering like so except these two topics remaining all topics are covered in your gate syllabus so what are those engineering mathematics digital logic database and computer organization architecture computer networks programming and data structures algorithm POC, cd operating systems mostly you have studied all of them right and the way you have studied for the gate is more than sufficient you don't need that much in-depth concepts for the nullity exam Okay, but you need to cover the breadth rather than depth for the NILIT exam. Okay, or the information technology ke liye syllabus kya hai? So engineering, mathematics, computer networks, digital logic, software engineering, computer programming, internet web programming, more object oriented techniques. There they may be asking like Java or uh, using and data structures and algorithm design algorithms, information management system, DBMS, operating system, COA. So here you do not have TOC compiler, so you are safe tied. When you are preparing for this but still you have a lot of uh, subjects to cover up when you go for electronics you will be having engineering mathematics control system digital logic electro emf uh, edc networks analog circuits microprocessor and microcontroller digital circuits co and signals and systems communications and digital communication systems so these are the subjects you need to cover when it comes to generic syllabus this is common for everyone right so there are two sections one section definitely you should be preparing uh, this will also carry more than 40 marks, right? Up to two, and you can use the Agarwal book to complete the reasoning English GK. So these are the uh, topics you have to prepare, and mostly up to two, English reasoning is covered in gate. And if you are already prepared for that, you are ready. At GK, you may use a Haryan publication or somebody uh, which is uh, going to help you to know the general knowledge. And how to prepare? This is the most important point. Uh, the main point is you should follow your syllabus and if you you know go out of the syllabus you will waste a lot of time so already covering the syllabus will require at least you know three to four months and then use the right resources like especially when you're going for technical portion you can use NPTEL or geeks per geeks to complete your syllabus as quickly as possible right and if you are going for technical portion you can prepare the gate pyqs isdo pyqs nic pyqs EGC, ugcnet or pyqs could help you a lot in cracking nilit exam so it's very easy uh, to understand uh, what pattern you require to prepare those subjects which are not covered here then you can use any objective type of questions to complete your preparation okay so and one uh, important information for all these students aspirants those people who want to prepare for gate cs and da after year both uh, the cs and the da ka batches announced that you start hone wala will be uh, kal se, 16th april se. So weekday batch is going to start from tomorrow. If you have not register or subscription, liya, so you may go for this subscription, which is uh, right now, you know, many people will think about like, I will prepare start preparing from July, August. So by the time you are passing the three, four months, this three, four months will give you at least three to four subjects, minimum completion so that will give you the advantage. So those people who are postponing or prolonging your preparation, 
then please start preparing from tomorrow which can help you to crack the, with the better score and weekend batch is starting from 26th april so this is also going to be available for both cs and dono ke liye da batch ke liye bhi right aur combo batch bhi combo batch bhi available hai agar kisi ko bhi uh, cs da placement ke sath bhi lena hai to unke liye bhi uh, with or without placement ke liye bhi uh, available hai so if you are interested along with your csr da you want to prepare for placements wo combo batch bhi available hai so as per your choice you can uh, choose and pass will vary accordingly so you know there are best mentors available on geeks for geeks so agar aapko jaldi gate crack karna hai aur ek saal mein gate crack karna hai to aapke paas bahut samay hai aur 8 to 9 months would be sufficient ab utna samay to hai aapke paas to agar gate prepare karna hai to please start preparing from tomorrow as weekend weekday batch is going to start and weekend is going to start from 26th april and these are the courses one year two year three year courses are available those who are in uh, final year they may choose for one year course those people who are in third year or second year they can choose two year course those people who are in first year or second year they can choose three year also so depends on your preparation you can go for the different options you have the upskill 30 uh, to get 30% discount on geeks for geeks you can use Yeah, Pradeep. If there is is if there is any mistake, you know, I apologize for that. We are not giving any uh, misleading information. And in case if any uh, typo, I'm sorry for that. But so how to prepare for NILIT exam? That's a, a the main mood of this uh, session. In case if you are not aware how to prepare for NILIT exam, then please uh, start preparing for it. In case the wrong post information is there. then that's okay but that's not the issue for uh, right now it's the issue for you is how to prepare for nilit exam right advertising uh, and god knows who is doing what right if you are advertising every day we are we will come for advertising why we teach really everything most of the time right and it's all choices like what you are speaking that's up to you but guys those people who are preparing for any kind of competitive exam and we will be there to help you our courses will help you and it doesn't matter whether you are paid or free we are there to help you that you know you might be you know connecting directly with us uh, we are spending the time uh, with you guys and whenever you have any trouble uh, we are there to talk directly we are not like just coming to youtube and you know giving some information we connect with those students who really need us and we really uh, help you if you really need a guidance any kind of suggestions you require we are there we can, you can connect with us on telegram and you can see that deva sir gate which is my telegram group you can directly message me on that too so you have lot of freedom to communicate with us and anyhow the comments and chat which is useless those people uh, who you know giving false information but anyhow if you feel that we are helping you then definitely we are there for you and try to connect with us and in case if you are uh, preparing for our uh, gate 2026 and there are batches already started and there are thousands of students have already taken the subscription and they were started like nearly uh, 2000 uh, students recently started the in the new batch that is a weekdays batch and still there are the batches which are going to be starting from tomorrow and in case you have not taken subscription there are many people who are uh, taking subscription for tomorrow batch and you can start preparing using uh, the uh, big day or weekend batch okay in case if you have any doubt please connect with us yeah 
uh, no Rahul. Uh, you should look at that's what I'm saying. Okay, this uh, video is uh, mainly for how to prepare, how to apply for NILIT exam. Any notification which comes, definitely we could have already, uh, you know, launched the video in YouTube. Please watch it. It is very important. No, it's not for the how to apply for NILIT exam. That's a different video. This video is specially for what is the syllabus, what is the exam pattern, how to prepare. These are the three important points and one slide which was added by the uh, team with number of vacancies and in case if any information which is not proper then definitely you should watch another video on the same channel. Yes. Right. So definitely if uh, the exam date and how to apply all this uh, will be uh, available on another video. Thank you so much uh, for attending this session. In case if you have any comments, you can uh, post below the video, we'll reply to you. Thank you so much.